For the Ottawa Paramedic Service, the stakes of its decision-making couldn't be higher. Life and death are literally on the line. The Ottawa Paramedic Service uh, provides paramedic services and 911 response uh, for the entire city of Ottawa. It's just over 2,700 square kilometres uh, with a population of about 900,000. Uh, within that, the paramedic service itself does 140,000 uh, emergency vehicle responses a year. And that's why making intelligent use of real-time data is so critical to the Ottawa Paramedic Service's success. Looking at how long it takes to process a 911 call or how long it takes an ambulance to respond to a scene or even what hospital we should be transporting a patient to. Uh, and we use the data to help drive all that decision making. I think healthcare is becoming data driven. You have to change the system and the only way to change the system is to look at the data. In an industry where seconds matter, the Ottawa Paramedic Service reimagined the way they responded to patient care. By partnering with Click to create real-time dashboards to keep paramedics, hospitals and dispatchers all on the same page, they greatly reduced response times. The real-time data certainly gives us the, uh, the gauge, if you will, of, of how our design decisions have influenced the system and how those decisions uh, might affect our response times at any given time, our overtime, our staffing levels. The introduction of uh, the dashboard within the paramedic service and our rollout uh, to the Ottawa hospitals uh, created uh, an improved relationship and situational awareness. This citywide initiative is transforming the way the Ottawa Paramedic Service handles and responds to patient care. Once they leave scene, we now start to, to push information out to the hospital uh, so it's visible on their click dashboard. Uh, so they, uh, they now know there's a new ambulance on the way to them. Uh, and about how long it'll take for that ambulance to get there. All along the way, we're actually using the dashboard uh, to help assist in the decision making as to where that patient should be transported. So the dispatcher is looking at the dashboard to see uh, how the last 20 patients have been distributed, uh, where the delays currently are, uh, and how many ambulances are at each of the hospitals to, to direct the ambulance and that patient uh, to the most appropriate facility. Uh, which in turn will result in a faster offload time where they can transfer the care to that patient over to the hospital and put that ambulance back in the community for another call. In healthcare, I don't think you can have very many conversations now unless it involves data. It allows both the ambulance team as well as the paramedic team to see what's happening in the region. So this kind of initiative hopefully will be helpful to allow us to compete and show us where we stand in real time. And I think on the frontline staff, that certainly allows us to put resources where we need them looking at coverage maps, predicting out what our response capacity is, and allowing the analytics to actually uh, decide on a vehicle movement to improve coverage, uh, to improve response times. Now, technology is turning reactive response into predictive process, allowing the Ottawa Paramedic Service to develop more effective and lasting plans that directly impact patient outcomes. Having the opportunity to lead a team through this really digital transformation and this data-driven decision-making um, it's really rewarding work.